Hey guys, I'm Nick, President and CEO here at Dryback TV, and today I'm going to be teaching you guys how you can grow your YouTube channels using social media, specifically Twitter, because that's what I've used to grow my channel in the past and, and seen success on. I don't have any experience with other social networks, guys, so I'm sorry, I can't really help you out with that. Facebook these days is just a lot of, you know, you have to buy ads and stuff like that, and we don't want that. We're looking for pre free promotion via social media. Let's go ahead and jump on into it. First off, you need to actually have a Twitter. So if you don't have a Twitter account, go make one. I promise that in your YouTube career, it will become very, very helpful to have. So how do we use Twitter to promote our channel and grow our channel? Twitter is a community in itself, and there are sub-communities on Twitter. For example, every single gaming YouTuber, every single vlogging YouTuber, every single YouTuber out there has a Twitter, I promise you. I, I don't know of any YouTuber with over 25,000 subscribers that does not have a Twitter. So that is a huge thing because that gives the little guy the opportunity to communicate with the bigger content creators on Twitter. I know there have been tons of people who I have just met on Twitter who I found their content because I met them on Twitter, and now I subscribe to them, I watch their live streams, all of that stuff, because they tweeted at me, got to know me, and then, you know, started communicating, and then eventually, after we had built a relationship via Twitter, we're like, hey, you know, I, I make my content myself, would you mind checking it out? Here's a link to my live stream. I go check out the live stream, it is amazing. I follow their live stream, check out their YouTube, subscribe on YouTube, it's just all so good! The reason I did that was because they communicated with me on Twitter and got to know me personally before sending me their content. This is the number one way that you can get in contact with larger YouTubers and grow with them and, and use some of their clout, some of their subscriber base and follower base to grow your channel. Twitter allows you to do that, allows you to make a connection. And that's what's something a lot of people don't understand. People think they're entitled to a shout out, entitled for the bigger YouTubers to give them a shout out. And that's not simply true. As someone who has a following, I know that I would rather build a relationship with a smaller YouTuber, get to know them, and then as time goes on, if they tweet me their content once, just once, and say, hey man, I know I haven't done this before, here's my video. I think it's really good. It's a home run video. It's amazing. Come check it out. Let me know your thoughts on it. That's all I'm asking. And uh, I'm more likely to do that if they've built a relationship for me. If I've seen them and they are always responding to my tweets, they're giving me their opinions, we're talking, we're having discussions on Twitter. That is how, I, this happened multiple times where I've found awesome YouTubers by doing this. And I wouldn't have checked out their video if they had just tweeted me and said, hey, check out my video. But no, they invested, they built a relationship with me via Twitter, and then they sent me their video. And because of that, it actually, you know, helped me click on that video when they did send it to me. I'm not gonna, if you just cold tweet me a video, and just tweet me a video and be like, Hey Nick, check this out. I'm not gonna look at it. It just it never happens. Zero percent of the time do I look at that. If you build a relationship for me, and then you send me a video that you think is a really good video, Right. If we have a relationship and then you send me a video that I think that you think is really good, I'll probably check that out because I know you one and I know your 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 opinions and at least through Twitter I know that. And you've built a relationship and you've said this is going to be a home run video. So all of those things make me be like, I'll check this out. And if I do and I enjoy it, I'll subscribe, I'll retweet you all that stuff because I think that's good. Other YouTubers do this as well, so make sure you build a relationship before you tweet a video. Tweeting a video at somebody does nothing. Building a relationship over time, over a few months, then tweeting a video does everything. This is the long term here, guys. We don't. It's impossible to blow up overnight on YouTube for most people. It's possible to do it, right? Tons of viral videos happen, and tons of people will go from 500,000 to a million subscribers overnight. Or... 50,000 to 150,000 overnight. But at the end of the day, this is a long race. So invest time and build relationships with these bigger YouTubers. But that's not the only way that Twitter can help you grow. Twitter can also help current followers that you have, your current subscriber base, connect with you in another location off of YouTube and find your videos if they might not see them in their subscription box. So many times people say, I'm so glad you tweeted that video because if you hadn't, I wouldn't have seen it. I wouldn't know it was a thing because, uh, well, 
it didn't show up in my sub box or I missed it in my subscriber box. But because you tweeted it, I was able to see it. So tweet out every video you have. Push your YouTube following base over to Twitter because it will it will help you in the long run. It'll help you get more views. It'll help you do all of that stuff. Social media is super important in that part. And, uh, and Twitter is great for it. Last but not least, Twitter allows you to connect with other creators, other content creators of your size. We did a video, uh, we did a video, which you can check out at dropbag.tv slash grow together, where you can see all the ways that we said you could connect with the other creators. We actually forgot to include Twitter in that. It has since been added, so if you go check that out now, you'll be able to see that and a link to this. But, nevertheless... Twitter is a great way to connect with other content creators and grow your channel. You can meet other creators that aren't bigger than you, that are the same size as you, sometimes even smaller than you, work with them, and then build up your audiences together. There are tons of ways to find other YouTubers to work with, and Twitter just adds another layer on top of that, another way for you to work with people, find people to work with, and grow together, because that's the best way to do it on YouTube these days. Anyway, guys, I'm Nick King, President and CEO here at Dryback TV. Did I forget something? I'm not perfect. Have you guys used Twitter to grow your channel in another way than I have mentioned in this video? If you have, Post it in the comment section down below, and I will be more than happy to check that out. If I think it's good, I'll add it in the description of this video and on dropback.tv slash grow with social, which is where you can actually see this video and all of that stuff. And guess what? If I like your idea enough and it is added to the description and to that blog post, I will give you credit linking to your YouTube channel. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. I am again Nick King, President and CEO of Dropback TV, and I am out. Peace.